I would say it's overrated, but also I blame myself for not having the patience or uh, the work ethic to wear jewelry. <laughs> Do you take them off? Do you put them on in the morning? At the same time, <clears throat> that's how they portray pirates. And you would think that pirates would not have that kind of time. You know, they really portray pirates as being very image conscious. I, like a lot of people in this day and age, have a complicated relationship with bread. I really wish that I could give my wholehearted endorsement of a bread bowl, because in my heart of hearts, it's a very, very comforting notion to have a bowl that you can eat. But I have successfully avoided bread bowls for some years now, and now I want one. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> High school reunions. Uh, overrated. Just the thought of it uh, f fills me with anxiety. Coincidentally, we're in Belleville for one of my high school reunions. It's actually a story in my book. I, I ran into some of my classmates, and they thought I was in town to go to the high school reunion. And they asked me if I still had a little band. It reminded me why I didn't want to go to the high school reunion. <laughs> All metal is underrated. All metal musicians, all genres of metal uh, is underrated. Say, for example, you listen to an indie rock station, like if you have Sirius XMU or something like that, and you listen to those bands and they're trying so hard to sound like they don't care about anything, and then you switch to liquid metal or some like super hardcore like black metal band or something like that, there is no mistaking that they give a shit. You can't do that without fucking working your ass off. So I'm always inspired by, by, by metal bands. This is genius. Weird Al is underrated. Name another artist that has their own completely uh, self-contained genre. You know, he's, probably, he's one of the only ones, you know, like just has made his own, his own world of what he does and you can't go anywhere else for Weird Al. If you want some Weird Al, you have to go to Weird Al. <laughs> Stuffed crust pizza is just overrated. It seems pretty disgusting to me. What difference does it make whether it's in the crust or on top of the crust? Is it just because they didn't think they could get enough cheese on top of the pizza? Is it because people didn't eat the crusts enough? Is it like the crust lobby? <laughs>